Good afternoon. Today we're looking at a uh, ETA 2824 Cologne. It was made in China, I'm sure. And uh, we had this brought in. And I, I did this because I'm going to build a 14 karat uh, solid gold man's uh, watch case. So I needed to have a prototype to go by. And until I can make sure that I, I'm capable of making it, I don't want to bring in a $200 watch movement. So we used the cologne to uh, build the uh, case with. And these are the, the clones so I can use the measurements from this and, and come up with the design. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, my uh, line of equipment, I, I have a uh, CNC milling machine. It's a tag. And I use a Mac 3 software to, to run the tag. I'm uh, using Fusion uh, 360 software. It's brand new to me. I've never used it before. But I wanted to change out my uh, software and try something different. And uh, this was an opportunity I couldn't refuse. I mean, it uh, looks like the uh, software is going to be pretty good. I uh, will let you know as we build this. So we're going to call this series uh, Watch Case Design Number One and uh, our series number one. And uh, as we build this watch up and, and put it together, we'll uh, have the videos on it. I also have a uh, Jet 10-inch lathe, and I also have a Craftsman 10-inch lathe that we'll be using as well. I also have a couple of jeweler's lathes, which uh, may, may uh, come into play too. So, all in all, we're going to use a, a real edit 2824-2 when we're done. And they're somewhere around 100 to 175 bucks. I'm really not sure. I've seen some good offers on a brand new one, and I have, you know, so we'll find out when the time comes. And uh, we'll see how well we do on this, this, this piece. Now, I still continue to do clockwork and uh, jewelry designing and jewelry making. And we do a lot of silver jewelry designing, so stay tuned for some, some more uh, uh, videos on that. I have to apologize. I've been off the air here uh, on making videos for about 10 days. I had some health issues that uh, I had to address. And uh, now I'm back and uh, feeling good. And uh, pretty, uh, pretty stoked to start t teaching some lessons again. Uh, we've been doing a, a lot of Black Hills Gold uh, design work uh, in silver. I'm going to continue to do that for a while until we have quite a few pieces designed. So then we'll take those designs that, as we build them and we'll uh, go into the plating room and we'll show you how we do a rhodium plate finish on them and uh, get them ready for retail sales. So stay tuned for that too. And, uh, and as well as we, we build clocks, re, or repair clocks and grandfather clocks. So I want to keep up with, with all of that too. So our schedule is pretty heavy this year and uh, I, I hope that we can make a... Uh, uh, quite a few series of, uh, of uh, videos on all of, all three areas watchmaking, jewelry, and, uh, and uh, clock. We're going to be casting I believe we're going to cast this. We're going to design it in, in, uh, in wax, the case, and the, uh, the bracelet or the, the watch band it, uh, will be made in uh, wax, lost wax casting and we'll, or we'll, we'll carve them in the wax and then we'll go ahead and build this uh, this and we'll cast it and you'll see how we do casting work you'll see how we uh, do plating work and you're going to see how we actually design this in 360 so I hope that uh, will intrigue a few people to, to zero in on us and follow along and uh, if you if you want to keep abreast with this uh, this new one project that we're doing this this watch case uh, you might want to uh, subscribe to the channel so you can find it a little easier but uh, that's up to you anyway uh, this is my first video uh, getting back to the uh, to the old uh, making videos and I'm having a lot of fun t today because I'm so happy to be back and we'll uh, we'll uh, chalk this one up as just a uh, talking video I guess uh, a demonstration of what we're going to be doing this is an automatic by the way I'll turn it over here and it's brand new uh, the workmanship on this Chinese uh, cologne 
is not bad. Uh, I, there's a few things I didn't like. Uh, the the, the uh, some of the screws aren't very very nice looking. Uh, you know, on a really good watch, the the screws are blued. Uh, these aren't, and I see where they put them together. They kind of boogered the the uh, slots in them. But other than that, this is a nice looking little movement. So I think uh, it'll it'll be a good. Uh, uh, prototype so we can design the, the the watch from that the watch case so I hope you would uh, tune in and watch the uh, the the making of a uh, 14 karat gold watch case and uh, in uh, the rest of our our videos clock making and watch making and uh, and uh, jewelry making so stay tuned uh, for the next uh, episodes coming up soon so with that I'll tell you thanks for watching as always I appreciate your uh, watching the, the videos, and uh, you have a nice day.